Okay, guys. Dulcinea, or I don't know what you're going to call the personality that showed up yesterday. Kind of like a female Tarzan has appeared, but at least she's back to being her old Doomer chick self. So, uh, whoever, whoever at least yesterday was in, uh, was, was in her brain says the love affair is still on with Hambone. All right, and it is now the first day of October. Yes, on this gorgeous day. Wishing uh, Dulcinea was here with me, but uh, she can't be here. We are going to ask the universe about what is the future of Hambone Little Pal <clears throat> and Dulcinea. <clears throat> okay, universe, give me a hint. Will Dulcinea, or will she not, be my Doomer chick forever? Okay, universe. Drum roll, please. And the answer is, if I can get into this damn fortune cookie, the answer to the question, will Dulcinea be my Doomer chick forever? forever. Alright, I have to put on both pairs of my old man glasses. Alright, this is certainly uh, <laughs> Alright! Uh, <laughs> the universe has come through in spades. This is my message. The message to Hambone Little Tail from the universe uh, <laughs> Uh, asking the question, will, will Dulcinea be my Doomer chick forever? I, I have already, obviously, anyone who has been following this love affair for the last two years uh, uh, has known I have already arrived at the this conclusion. The greatest mistake a man can make is to be afraid of making one. There you go. Thank you, universe. Talking about fear, the greatest mistake a man can make is to be afraid of making one. So am I afraid of the, uh, of the, the obvious mistake of, uh, <laughs> start, starting a, or continuing a love affair with Dulcinea? Again, it all comes back to the heart versus the head. My head knows goddamn well, as I assume, uh, at least on uh, alter alternating days, Dulcinea's head knows goddamn well. Uh, the same thing about me. My head knows uh, continuing... This ill-fated love affair with Dulcinea is a major fucking, uh, a, a major fucking, uh, it's, it's beyond a mistake. What would, it would be, it would be one of the biggest fuck-ups that I have made. Uh, and so, fear of making a mistake by pursuing my love affair with Dulcinea is coming from the head, but this is why I follow my heart. My, uh, my heart continues to tell me uh, that Dulcinea is my doomer chick forever, and uh, you know, if, if I had followed my head instead of my heart, I would probably, you know, uh, be living in a beautiful home in uh, South Austin, Texas right now. If I'd followed my head, I would probably, hell, be making $200,000 a year by now. If I had followed my head, I would be at least a millionaire, if not a multimillionaire. If I had followed my head, 
Uh, I would have had dozens, if not hundreds of friends. If I had followed my head, I would have a healthy, vibrant sex life. Uh, but no, I followed my heart. <clears throat> So I could be sitting here in this trashed out pickup truck in a, in a parking lot in Ithaca, New York by myself uh, getting ready to go spend a bunch of fucking money at Lowe's. <coughs> so it is a damn good thing that I did not let fear uh, keep me <coughs> from... Uh, following my heart to get uh, where I am today and I have the same faith that my heart will lead Dulcinea to my side sooner or later. Thank you universe for clarifying. I've already lost it. <clears throat> Bye guys.